All right, let's get a check of your first alert forecast now with meteorologist Tony Schiparoli. And two morning events we had listed there, Tony. One at 7.30, one at 9 this morning for those who want to go out and pay their respects. Yeah. So weather for this morning into the day, how are we looking? Um, it's going to be nice and calm, other than a little bit of some patchy fog trying to push in right now, guys. But at least the dryness is there. And speaking of, you can see this cloud layer that is right around where our tower cam is looking over downtown Columbia. But as I say it again, the dryness will take hold. And then into the afternoon, more of sun will work to break out. So anything with this layer above us will really work to thin. You just got to be patient. I promise you some sun will finally work to be there as we go on into this Memorial Day Monday. Now we work on to see mid upper 50s around the region. We got 56 for Lexington, Columbia upper 50s right now. We push it on to Newberry 54. A little cooler out that way. Saluda, you're right around 50 degrees. Coolest out towards the west. Now we go up to Camden though. How about 61 there down to Orangeburg 58. So these differences are going to be in play that widespread range really even further out towards the west to anywhere to the east from 50 to 60. A lot of temperatures in between for all of our communities. We get to the tidbits. We see things drying out today. First one on the board. I'm sure that's going to be a big one for people as sun works to increase. Yes, we still see humidity hanging around as sun works to actually, of course, evaporate some of the moisture we've absorbed at the surface and then we get back to warmth. So all this means for us a very stagnant pattern into the week where we see a lot of highs near 80, but not much in the way of sun, especially later into the week with all this moisture that should linger around. It's going to be a very stagnant pattern, more so reminiscent of what we should be seeing earlier in May, but we're going to be getting it now for the late phases of May. Continuing on to the future cast today for any ceremonies going on, anything you might be taking part in outdoors, you actually need to be mindful of the sun that, is, that breaks out later into this one. You know, make sure you're keeping a bit cool, protecting your skin, actually back to a very high UV index as we get into the afternoon. So we see the sun return, but as I stated, and I'm sure many of you can agree, it's going to be a welcome change for today that works to change pace again into the week. So we could even lose a bit more sunshine after Tuesday, but here we go. Speaking of Tuesday for tomorrow, after we get past what is a drier Memorial Day, we work to see a little bit more of isolated showers, a couple of storms possible just because of what's going on with any moisture being absorbed back up into the atmosphere from the surface. So we see that tomorrow, but I'm still not too impressed with any of these things that will be popping up. Anything very short lived with actual accumulating rain. It's still going to be something I want to make sure you are mindful of, but still lower end of the spectrum for more of that rain to pan out as we continue to push on into this week. We work on into Wednesday. Similar story, a little bit of clouds, a couple little bits of moisture, but nothing too crazy. And we could even see a little bit more sunshine. Try to work back through by the end of the day because we'll get a bit of a northeasterly breeze. There's drier air up to the north trying to fight back in to South Carolina. Now today, of course, yes, Memorial Day Monday for us here in the Midlands. It's going to be a much nicer weather outlook than we've seen the past few days. I'm hoping a lot of you could take solace in that fact. Getting highs approaching 80 today. They should fall just short in the upper 70s for many, but still a lovely day works to take shape, especially after we get past some early morning clouds and some patchy fog. And then overnight period, we get back to more clouds mixing in, but comfy with those temperatures near 60. Now this is what I'm talking about. Just very pesky into the week will be a lot of spotty rain chances. Nothing widespread, but just trying to pop up here and there, working to pop a little bit more to even some storm potential to kickstart the upcoming weekend. But as you see, Memorial Day Monday looks to be pretty calm with highs again approaching 80.